Welcome back to another video. Hope you are having a great day. And today to take a look at an app that promises to move ourselves without moving ourselves. Now, in the past, we have seen an app similar to this one, but it required a computer connected to the mobile phone. This one right over here will fake our GPS loop location without having the need of a computer now i'm going to share with you everything that i've tried so far with the app it's called i any go fake gps i will leave a link down below so that you can check out i did receive a free license so that i could test myself and give my opinion and share with my community and that being said let's go straight for it now, it has a few things here on the interface and we have seen the menu right over here, which at this moment doesn't matter too much. I have right at the bottom the speed that I want to move myself and we also have a few things that we are going to try right now. Now, if I want to change my location uh, fast and let me change to Google Maps so that you can see that the location is the same. And uh, by the way, it looks like I'm near the river. I don't live that near near the river. I live about two kilometers from there. So it's the same location right over here. Now, if I select, let's say, this point, and if I press the first choice here, it will jump immediately there. And now, if I go here on Google Maps, we can see that I'm no longer here. I'm here after the bridge. <laughs> this is really cool. Now, there is something here, which is a cooldown, and we will see that in a moment, which is when we do this jump, we will need to wait a moment if we are playing Pokemon Go as a safety so that it doesn't know that you are faking your G. PS. So this will be useful. Let's select a different point here and if I press go successfully modified and as you can see we have a cooldown now of 54 seconds. So this will depend on the distance that you do. Now this is one of the ways that we can move. The other way that I can move is you can see this directional button right over here. Let me increase the speed and if I press it like this you can see that I'm starting to move right over there, which is really, really cool. Now, really cool as well is if I go to Google Maps and I'm no longer here, I'm right over there. What I can do is, because I still have the directional buttons here overlaying my phone, so I can put it anywhere I want, and I can also move. So at this moment, I'm on Google Maps and I can do this on any app that I want. I can fake my location and we are going to do that in just a few moments in Pokemon Go so that you can check it out. So this is one of the ways that we can also move. Now let's go to the app and we are on this location right now. Now besides that way that we have seen, we can also select this location here for example. Then if I press the second option, which is this itinerary right over here, it will go from point A to be on this route and I can actually increase the speed for example I can just go 20 30 the maximum is 30 kilometers per hour and we can see that I'm moving right over there so now if I go to Google Maps it's it did jump but it is now following the track that we selected which is really really cool now i don't use this personally but i have to give credit that it is it is really really cool to see our location changing without moving at least and here i can pause for example and it will pause and if i press play again it will keep on moving and it will go to the target that we have selected and we are almost reaching and there we go move done now there is also other option which we can use it might be useful in some cases which is this one right over here so I can select several points I can say okay go here and then go here and then go here and then go there and there and sorry about that it goes in a straight line but you get the idea and then we can say okay start moving and it will start doing that uh, track that we selected let's go and put it at 30 kilometers per hour and if i go to google maps we can follow and see that at this moment is moving 
and probably I should have done this if it was a real situation uh, on the streets line up so that it, we see that everything is real but I just uh, scratched a few lines and that was it but we can see that it's moving on one app and it's moving on the Google Maps as well and of course if we use an other app it will do exactly the same behavior so this is basically what we can do in terms of movement in terms of speed in terms of the ways that we can move any app that you want to do I don't know any objectives anything and you are by some reason inhabilitated to move out of your way then this might be a great or to do some pranks I don't know and I can show you right over here once again the name of the app is I any go fake GPS link will be down below so that you can check out all the specifications and what you can do and whatnot that being said if the video was helpful don't forget the usual thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen my name is Roberto George and as always I'll see you on the next one.